ဒီကောင်းမှာတို့ပါဟိုလေ့လာကြပြီဆိုဒီ any memoir to a component go memorize to be you know she any prop the one or any component tema she a prop to chain the account of it thing are a memo ga a lot of be you know she prop the chain moves into a matha be or the copy of you are ready component go random look be below la at the rendering one or below at the comma to render it will look be on a component of the mirror ဟုတ်တယ်မလားဒီဆိုရင်တော့ဒီညာမှာကျွန်တော်ကဘာ the component tema you like there, below she are list tema theta like initial value. Below she did any to do go render low tab, you know, below she did my prop and in it. Mm, that tab, eh, hold them la. Okay, so what did you have my good general gia? The component, well, no, I read the to do component, uh, penetrating to a render low the lace, wa. The my console dot log, eh, you know, are, mm, component is render, so be me, no, be no. Okay, the magic to render lo pia bi to idea out my prop in it. But let's what you go refresh piano like me to a patama zone and then I read the to do component, but not the component go to a render lo pia. Oh, we know now to cut you know what increase name, you know the magic to render lo pia to him like oh my ball. So you know as a the memo ma deep yet and I will be simple and robot don't the less of memo don't him la. Okay, as a dinner, my legend of memo it don't ya in zone memo. โอ้ฟังก์ชันอันนี้เนี่ยเทไลท์มั้ยเนาะตัวเนี่ยเทโกอีเซฟไลท์มั้ยโอเคสุดปามาดอดะเลคอมโพเนนต์อีสนอตเ
ตัวดูเท่ามันก็รู้ดีเมมโมตรงเท่าอยู่เว้ยแต่เมมโนท่าบาลูเรนดาผิดเตะเลยบ่มันเลยดีคอมโพเนนต์อ่ะตัวเต
Okay, so we are going to use the callback to the board to go to the menu. So we are going to go to the menu, memorize the menu. So we are going to use the dependency to read the second parameter. So we are going to use the parameter to read the callback function. So we are going to use the dependency to read the dependency to read the function. So we are going to use the dependency to read the brand. Okay, so we are going to use the dependency to read the function. Okay, so we are going to use the dependency to read the function.